on your request i shall be taking solid state so in this video i shall be dealing only with the basics of them so that in the next video we can get clear with the topics so first of all i will be teaching you drawing the cube and the bevis lattice in this video so let me take a regular shape see this is a shape in which i take the x axis y axis and the z axis but actually these are not the x y z axis these are just labeled as them because the angle can vary between the axes let me take the angle between x and y axis to be alpha y and z axis to be beta and x and z axis to be gamma okay so with the help of these parameters these are the angle parameters and the side parameters are taken to be a b and c you can see i have written separately so that you can uh, understand it very well so c b a b is this a is this and c is this okay so now these are the parameters so basically how many parameters can i have three of intercepts which are a b and c and how many parameters of angle can i have three parameters alpha beta and gamma so now let me apply a simple thing a very simple thing i want to tell you through mathematics see how many parameters of intercepts i have 1 2 3 and for inter interfacial uh, angle i have three angles so basically how many crystal systems should i get 3 into 3 that is 9 through basic permutations and combinations but how many crystal systems do we have only 7 why because some of the systems get repeated so they are not taken into consideration okay so now let me begin with the basic of thing so first of all let's discuss the names with the help of the parameters so first of all we take the cubic system then we take the tetragonal system the next one is orthorhombic i shall tell you a way to remember all of them next is hexagonal the next one is rhombohedral rhombohedral is also called as trigonal in some books but i will go according to the ncert so the next one is monoclinic so this topic is very important because some of the questions can be asked from it because it is of cramming type nature so it will be triclinic the last one so now let's begin with the parameter now how to learn first of all just learn in the order that i have told you okay now let's decide the intercept parameters just do according to me first of all take all of them to be equal so take all of them to be equal that is a is equal to b is equal to c that is all the three lengths will be equal so what we get basically a cube as simple as that now let's take the second case where i have to put one not equal sign just begin from this end so in the next what i will be getting is a not equal to b not equal to c okay now we have now we have put one not equal to sign now start removing the not equal to sign we have we are we are going from this direction like this we are going like this so we have to return so i will be returning this way that simple physics so now what to do next now remove the first equal to sign from this place so it will be a is equal to b not equal to c now what will be the next one that is a is equal to b is equal to c okay i hope till now it's helping you now the next one will be a not equal to b not equal to c and the next one will also be not a not equal to b not equal to c in the last two cases we get the values as not equal now what is the next thing that can be learned that how to learn the name of these things now let me tell you the way that i have learned c for c i have taken class t for test o for on h for holiday now stop here now it is class test on holiday now the next one i have learned is ride mercedes why because we all have to work hard to gain it so let's crack some of the best exam in the nation and get to the best position in life so class test on holiday ride mercedes together give the class test on holiday and then enjoy your life so now let's get to the interfacial angle which is alpha beta and gamma so now in the first case so the basic one which is alpha is equal to beta is equal to gamma is equal to 90 degree now what is this shape this shape is a cube visualize with it visualize with me okay now the next one will also be alpha is equal to beta is equal to gamma is equal to 90 degree okay now let's get to the third one 
then this also will be getting alpha is equal to beta is equal to gamma is equal to 90 degree okay now in the next one only next one gives a little bit of pain and that is alpha is equal to beta is equal to gamma alpha is equal to beta is equal to 90 degree and gamma is equal to 120 degree okay in the next one just put a not equal to sign it will give us a gamma is equal to alpha but gamma is not equal to 90 degree and beta is also not equal to 90 degree just shift one one angle first start with 90 degree then also 90 degree then we are replacing just one one angle from the cube so with the help of visualization you can realize it just learn the intercepts on the axis properly that will help you a lot now let's go to the next one that is monoclinic so alpha will be equal to gamma is equal to 90 degree and beta is not equal to 90 degree now let, let's get to the last case that is triclinic in this alpha will not be equal to beta is not equal to gamma is not equal to 90 degrees so this is the last case so how to learn the intercepts a is equal to b is equal to c then just reverse the direction of placing one not equal to sign now let's learn brevis letters so first of all in all in all of these you have to place the primitive place primitive in all of these primitive primitive all of these what is the primitive primitive is the basic cell that we take where the atoms are at the corners so that I will discuss in the next lecture so in the first one place FCC and BCC okay where FCC stands for face center and BCC stands for the body center now let's get to the next one now this will be only primitive and along with BCC the next one will be FCC BCC and H center also so this one is the most important that I can say now primitive primitive and H center okay so this will be the basic arrangement of the Bravais lattice that is primitive FCC BCC and EC so in the next video I shall be taking the various uh, cubic cells and discuss a lot on them so if there are any doubts you can definitely ask me in the comment section leave a like if you definitely like the video and appreciate it thank you